Hi, I'm Michael Furseth with Baronet Blinds. This evening we're going to be doing a little late season turkey hunting up here in northern Wisconsin. Seeing it's raining and we got some time to kill anyways, we thought we would uh, do a little video showing you how to shoot through the mesh on one of our blinds. It's a question I get a lot. My answer to people when they ask that question, can I shoot through the mesh, is always, hey, why don't you try it? You got to actually try your setup. Um, depends on your broadhead, depends on your fletchings, depends on what kind of arrow you got. You know, it takes only about 30 seconds to pop up one of these blinds, shoot through a window without the mesh at a known yardage, um, and then put the mesh on and try that same shot and see if it affects your point of impact. So we got a target set up at about 30 yards behind this blind. We're going to hop in a blind and we're going to do exactly what I said. We're going to shoot through an open window without mesh and then put the mesh on, shoot through that same window and show you how it doesn't affect the point of impact. As you can see, we're shooting without the mesh, we hit the top right hand corner of the bullseye. With the mesh, we hit right at the top of the bullseye. The two impact points were within, it, within an inch of each other, and that's about as good as I can shoot at 30 yards with my crossbow. So if you're going to try blind hunting with the mesh, I recommend that you do what we did here today, where you shoot through the mesh at a known yardage where you know you're accurate um, before you go out. If you are accurate with your setup, then it's just that much better concealment you're gonna be that much more effective as a blind hunter. For more information about this Pentagon blind or all of our big Baronet blinds, check out baronetblinds.com.